worst part about being in a hotel? Pushing one of these things. President Snow put in the dress order himself, says Sinna. He unzips the bag, revealing one of the wedding dresses I wore for the photo shoot. Heavy white silk with a low neckline and tight waist and sleeves that fall from my wrists to the floor and pull. Everywhere pearl. Stitched into the dress and in ropes at my throat, and forming the crown for the veil. Even though they announced the quarter quell the night of the photo shoot, people still voted for their favorite dress. And this was the wig. The president says you're to wear it tonight. Our objections were ignored. I rub a bit of the silk between my fingers, trying to figure out President Snow's reasoning. I suppose, since I was the greatest offender, my pain and loss and humiliation should be in the brightest spotlight. This, he thinks, will make that clear. It's so barbaric, the president turning my bridal gown into my shroud that the pull strikes home, leaving me with a dull ache inside. Well, it'd be a shame to waste such a pretty dress, is all I say. into her chest. Chapter 22 Peter drops the sheath and buries his knife into the monkey's back, stabbing it again and again until it releases its jaw. He kicks the mud away, bracing for more. I have his arrows now, a loaded bow, and Finnick at my back, breathing hard but not actively engaged. Come on then, come on, shouts Peter, panting with rage. Will you quit but doing something this? has happened to the monkeys. They are withdrawing, backing up trees, fading into the jungle, so as annoying. if some unheard voice calls them away. Card. A game card. maker's voice telling them this is enough. Get her, I say to Peter. We'll cover you. Peter gently lifts up the morphling and carries her the last few yards to the beach while Finnick and I keep our weapons at the ready. But except for the orange carcasses on the ground, the monkeys are gone. Peter lays the morphling on the sand. I cut away the material over her chest, revealing the four deep puncture wounds. Blood slowly trickles from them, making them look far less deadly than they are. The real damage is inside. By the position of the openings, I feel certain the beast ruptured something vital. A lung, maybe even her heart. She lies on the sand, gasping like a fish out of water, sagging skin, sickly green, her ribs as prominent as a child's, dead of starvation. Surely she could afford food, but turned to the morphling much turn to drink, I guess. Everything about her speaks of waste. Her body, her life, the vacant look in her eyes. So we just got home and I'm pumped. Uh, I know this vlog is very late. It is 10 to 7 and I haven't even edited this yet. My guess is it'll be up around 8.30. That's pretty late. So we're still unpacking and um then I'll get to editing and, you know, converting and then uploading. So, Skylar was going to come over, but he went out to eat. And so maybe once he gets back, um, maybe he'll be able to come over. And hopefully that'll, that'll be in tomorrow's vlog. 
and hopefully tomorrow's vlog was, it will be good. I hope you guys saw the video that Dylan posted uh, uh, earlier yesterday. Yesterday, I um, mean, oh, no, earlier today because um, you, you know today because I told him to um, uh, do that just so you guys would know what happened with the vlog today, and now you guys know if you watched it. You guys probably went to the channel to check out the vlog, and only that video was up, which is good. Hopefully you watched it to see why uh, this vlog was late, and it's still late. <laughs> so, I know Dylan said um, this vlog was going to be longer than expected. He got mixed up. Um, I I was trying to say, like, the Cedar Point vlog, which is in four days, Cedar Point is in four days, um, is going to be a, a lot longer. This vlog is not. This vlog is probably going to be shorter. But my point was, you know, I he got mixed up, which is okay. But four more days till see the point. Are you guys excited? You guys gotta be excited. There's no words to, uh, for me to describe describe how, how pumped and excited I am. All right, well I gotta go unpack and then I'll talk to you guys after. That. So I want to apologize for the late vlog. I know you. I, I don't have that much of a big fan base, but for the people that do watch these daily, it's I, I don't know. But, at least I didn't, at least, well, it's not like I didn't vlog today. It's not like I didn't try to get it up. And I'm, I'm still going to try, obviously. And this whole vacation I've tried. I remember last year, you know, when I was doing there was like one minute vlogs. As I was saying, those one minute vlogs that I told you about on my other channel, Colin 65 tv 2 which I don't do anymore. Um, we went on a two week road trip out west to like Vegas, uh, Zion, Yellowstone, you see, if we would have done that this year, I still would have been trying to do these vlogs only because I just realized how, I don't know, it's just, I've had, I, I, I have a lot more discipline now, um, I don't know, I, I'm basically just talking about random stuff because I um, because I want to get this done as fast as I can. Um, and I know you guys will probably bore the first first forty minutes. Uh, jeez, first four minutes of this vlog because it was just clips, uh, you know, of the road. And if you are wondering what that uh, like voice is, that like a lady voice that you hear, some of these clips. They're listening to this audio book, The Hunger Games. And, uh, that's what they were doing. That's what they were listening to. Um. Uh. Yeah, I, I want to congratulate CTF for see if we can 1500, uh, uh, consecutive days of vlogging and they didn't even miss a couple days they didn't even miss one day um congratulations to ctfxc you got 1500 days in a row that's pretty awesome i know i'm pretty delayed but i couldn't really talk about that on my vacation so that's really awesome they're you know they're just becoming every each and every day that they upload a vlog they're becoming more of a uh, a uh, role model to me to you know keep this going because they They've shown me how to do it and the benefits of it and stuff. Yeah, it's. If you guys like these vlogs, you will. He's raging. No wonder why I swear. That's hilarious to me, I don't know why, but it's funny, only because he's not raging on me. <laughs> so, while my dad is still raging, and, uh, while it's 7.19, I'm going to end this vlog so I can get it up. Uh, thanks uh, for, you know, watching this whole week's vlogs, you know, with the uh, vacation. It was really fun. 
And I'm sorry, uh, I was going to get some really awesome uh, GoPro footage of the amusement park, but I forgot that one little piece. If you have a GoPro, you know you need that one little screw. Forgot that little piece of shit. It doesn't matter. I got to get a three minute video, three minute vlog on the uh, Ferris wheel. That was at least some interesting. Alright, uh uh. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Peace on the streets. Four more days till Cedar Point. Um, I'm